You must be the mage. Yennefer of Engerberg. We need your help. Your heartbeat is extraordinarily slow. You're a mutant. A witcher. Geralt of Rivia. The famous white wolf. Fishing for a gin seems an extreme measure to remedy sleeplessness. I'm desperate. I thought you'd have fangs or horns or something. I had them filed down. Yaskia here needs immediate attention. And then, if you'd like, I'll indulge your curiosity all night long. You're created by magic. Our magic. Thank you. Made from magical childhood. Judging by your wrists and your wits, your childhood was very happy. But I would to fix you up nicely. I've determined your company and conversation payment enough. Do you doubt my capabilities? No, just your intentions. That scent, lilac and... Gooseberries. Tough to get in your head. How is it that I've walked this earth for decades without coming across a witcher, and then the first one I meet I can't get rid of? I'd say something strange was afoot, but then again, witches are bound to bump into monsters eventually. <laughs> you have a strong will. But you can't contend with me. This is not what you came for. I came for you. Do you regret it? Becoming a witcher? It's hard to regret something you didn't choose. Did you dream of being a mage? I didn't have much of a choice either. She wants to become more powerful. But she'll die. Well, let's pray for her. On our way out of town. Did you always want to become a mother? I dreamed... of becoming important to someone. Someday. Do I bore you? Not at all. <laughs> Leave the very sexy but insane witch to her inevitable demise. She saved your life, Yaskia. I can't let her die. Before we met, the days were calm. And the nights were restless. But now... I can see why Geralt didn't want to lose you. What does that mean? Vinrind. The Jinn. That's why we can't escape each other. Why I feel this way inside. No. It's not because of anything real or true. You made a wish. It's magic. It's real, Yen. How could we ever know? Every time I'm near you, I say more in five minutes than I've said in weeks. And I always regret it. Disregard for others' freedom has become quite your trademark. I made that wish to save your life. I didn't need your help! Like fuck you didn't. Yennefer, do not tell me you've traveled all this way for made-up fertility cures using fresh dragon hearts. They're not made up. They are. And seriously, you, a mother. Permitting my success so long as you command it yourself! And you, you flit about like a tornado, wreaking havoc. And for what? So you can have a baby? A child is no way to boost your fragile ego, Yen. What could you possibly want with a child? They took my choice. I want it back. Damn it, Yennefer! Tell me what you want! I want everything! Make your wish. You can have anything you want. You could choose not to be a witcher! to save you both a lot of hurt with a little pain now. 
The sorceress will never regain her womb. Though you didn't want to lose her, Geralt, you will. Is she alive? Please tell me who she is. Doesn't matter. She's gone now. I thought after Sodden, after everything they did to her at Eretus, she would make her way here for refuge. After? Sodden? After she burned through Nilfgaard's army and saved the continent, we should all be praising her name. Yen's alive. Did you think about me after Kangorn? From time to time. You hurt me. I don't know. You weren't alone in your pain. How is this possible? I don't care. Yen, your heart has been beating fast this whole time. This is my dear friend. And you must be his child surprise. Why are you here? I have some wounds that refuse to heal. Yen. Stop. I wish I could. The girl. Yours? This means nothing to you, but I understand now how special she is. We have to protect her. Yes. No. But what you see in there, it isn't real. You are ours. Villain Treden must told us we were made for each other, and that nothing would come of it. Because destiny alone is insufficient. Something more is needed. She is something more. There is another ghost that haunts us. What I did to you. I know I cannot change the past. But I will do everything in my power to help Ciri grow her magical skill. And to help keep her safe. I don't forgive you, Yennefer. I know I've hurt you. Yet I can't help but wish you could begin again. Use your knowledge of magic to train the girl. You're the only person who's helped to control her powers. I can magically intuit your thoughts, Geralt been wanting to invite me to dinner ever since we arrived. Have I? <laughs> no. <laughs> I think you need to hide your hair and mask your eyes. Would it kill you to say you look lovely? All done. Are you two fucking again? Subtle, Bjarkin. These nights were amazing. The mornings. They were lonely. You often left before dawn. I know why I left, but why did you? I was unsure if it was actually what I wanted. Or just some trick of the djinn's magic. Are you ready? And now? Again, I... Just say this isn't goodbye for good. That there are more good nights to come. That you will, in whatever form, think of me. Geralt. That's my promise to you. What happened? What's wrong? Who uses illusions? Hates me. And has a history of experimenting on young women. Lilac and gooseberries. Now that I can tolerate. It'll be our word against his. He won't have any words because I'm going to kill him. You sure about this? 
are you? To be safe until the morning. And I have you. The real you. In the flesh. Don't even think about it. I gave you my word. What do you think, Witcher? I think Yen looks particularly lovely this evening. Just admit that you loved her. Unbelievable. I believe they both did. I thought our performance was quite convincing. As jewels in my honor go, this one certainly broke into the top three. Oh, well, it was an honor to fight for the capricious heart of Yennefer of Vankerberg. To us. And a nearly perfect evening. I love you. It's the first time you've ever said that. It can't be. I used to think it. Tonight you actually said it. You can kiss me now. It's our first night out together. And all I can think about is getting you alone. Yeah, you came. It's me. We didn't come this far just to abandon each other. Then don't abandon me. I have to do this. I'm so sorry. I don't have her. It's my fault. No matter where you go or where you hide, we will never be apart. Who do we have now? We have you yet. <laughs> I will find Siri. Destiny brought us together. Never lost. Always found. It's not fair. You shouldn't like to lose you yet. But you have me. Tonight we'll end. Come back to us. You'd always been afraid. Until now, because she'd taken everything from you, which means she'd also taken the fear. You and I, we now know what it means to need, to love, to lose it all. Neutrality be damned. We are no longer afraid. <laughs>